Yes, beats, make it funky, funky, funky. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, JB. If y'all follow me on social media, Instagrams, my Facebooks, Twitters, all that good stuff, y'all know that I did get me a bike. Not a typical motorcycle, but I got me a Can-Am Riker Rally. This is a 900, the 900 edition, you know what I'm saying? I'm just giving you guys a quick walkthrough of my new bike. I just graduated from that MSF course. Listen, I'm here in uh, Enterprise, Alabama. This is a course that I think everybody should do. Brent and Dothan, man, amazing. That dude literally walked us through the whole step, but the course that I did was a regular motorcycle course. It wasn't for a three-wheel motorcycle. I did it on two wheels, but the endorsement covers the endorsement covers um, three wheels as well. This is the Riker. I'm just gonna give you guys a quick walkthrough of the bike. It's brand new, this is a 2024. This is a 2024 Riker Rally. It had one mile on it when I got it. Definitely wanna do um, customizations on this bike, like this foot pad. I got it in Dothan at the, um, the uh, Harley Davidson. Uh, location so we gonna get right into it I did buy this this mount if you know anything about customizations of the Riker please let me know websites and everything like that but let's just go ahead and get straight into it all the videos that I saw on this bike I learned from YouTube before I took the actual class which went more in depth like how to start it how to do all that so I, I kind of knew how to do all that good stuff so but I'm gonna show you guys how I did it um, and then we just go ahead from there. The first thing we got is our high beams and low beams, you know. We got our blinkers right here. We got the blinkers. We have a horn right here. This is cruise control. I haven't used it yet. Um, hopefully like on a longer trip, I will be using it. We have a mount. This is for your phone. My phone fits perfect. I did 50. That was the most I ever did on this bike so far. and no problems obviously we got our mirrors um this is when we turn it on i'll show you what this does right this is our emergency brake right here the emergency brake is here so right now the emergency brake is off well now it's off so i can rock this bike back and forth so you always want to put it up to do the emergency brake this right here is the key this is the key you can't put it on your keychain i just have it in right now so you just put it in there and be good to go. We got a foot peg right here. There's no clutch. This is an automatic bike. It's an automatic bike. This right here, this lever right here is forward and reverse. You push it forward to drive, you push it back to reverse. You know what I'm saying? Now to the other side. The other side, we got our kill switch. With it being up, like how it is right now with this push down right this right here it would you can't start the bike in order to start the bike you have to push this down right you gotta push that down this right here once this is pushed down you push that this will cut on right then we'll, we'll get into that when i mount the bike so coming down here we have another foot peg and then we have our brake this is an automatic bike there's no front brake. If everything is done down here. There's no clutch. Everything is done down here. It's automatic. All right, so let's mount it up and let's start her up. Oh, before we do that, let me go over here. Because I don't have a helmet on right now. My helmet was on my bag. DOT approved, man. Always wear a DOT approved helmet. I don't, you see the HD Harley Davidson? That's where I got my bike from. That's where I got this helmet from. 
This is a, I got a big dome. This is a, a double XL. And it fits very comfortable for my head size. You see it right there. This is a good helmet. No, no, it doesn't have Bluetooth. Uh, so, like I said, there's no clutch, no nothing. You just flip your leg over and you get busy. Boom. All right. So the first thing that we need to do when we get up on here, we have to start her up. Um, like I said, we got the kill switch. So what you want to do is you want to activate it, push this down, right? We have the foot brake right there. You want to put your foot on it, right? Why? Pay attention. Start her up. You see? It's doing that right now. It says before operating, it's going to tell you to look at the um, the manual to bypass all that. Which you have to do it every time. You have to throttle this forward. So roll your arms forward, right? You hear that click? You see it went away, right? So here, you see with the parking. I have. 22.2 miles on here you know what i'm saying uh my fuel level my rpms miles per hour um if you're overseas looking at this video this will be in miles per hour then you got your high and cool you know what i'm saying um so my foot's on the brake we did everything now we just gotta start her up so you have to foot on the brake you have to keep this throttle forward and then Now, now we cooking. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but now, now we're cooking with grease. So we got our high beams and low beams. It's bright outside. How you know your high beams is going? You see the blue light? Okay. Then we have our turn signals. Want to go left? Want to go right? This bike has an automatic stopping, but if you're not used to that, all you have to do is click it. Push it in, and it'll go away. Then we have our horn. You see what I'm saying? So now, look. We got our parking brake. Now I'm able to, you see what I'm saying? I got it in the forward. I'm able to rock back and forth. But with this up, I can't do nothing. It's stuck. So now what I'm going to do is, I don't have... Let me cut her off. Okay, so I don't have a mount for my helmet yet. I do have a chest rig. We're just gonna um, ride around the city real quick, ride around through Enterprise, and then um, probably Daleville just to get like a good feel. If you guys are riders and y'all in the area, just comment below um, and we could go ahead and ride out, man. But for me, I'm gonna go ahead and get my gear on and then we're gonna, we gonna make it do what it do, baby. Let's get it. I forgot to tell you, y'all guys probably can't hear me. I'm not sure I got my helmet on, but there is a trunk. It's a trunk in the front. And uh, it's right here. You push that down. And then I just have my paperwork from the dealership in there. It ain't much. That's why I always bring a book bag whenever I arrive. All right, let's get it.